guys welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel i am Ipo and i am back with another video if you are new here i am Ipo and i'm a lifestyle youtuber and i'm also a lash artist yes you guys should please follow me on my socials i'll put it here and also in the description box below before we get right into the video you guys should subscribe to my channel like this video and check out my other videos um comment share to your friends family whosoever share and i hope you guys enjoy the video so yeah let's get right into the video as you guys can see by the title of this video this video is a university q and a and is about edition if you're a fresher coming into abroad or you just graduated from secondary school you are looking for information based on abroad and you have questions like oh what's the cut of mark for nursing what's the cut of mark for law what's the dressing code for pharmacy what do i need to get in my work that will qualify me to get admission into abroad um what's the cut of mark for jam for abroad and also if you are like wondering how is the position like in abroad how is it done? All those questions, you know. My time to research, like based on questions people have been asking me. So like I just decided that instead of answering people like no one, why can't I just make a video? Sit down, relax, get pen, get your paper if you need one. And you guys should enjoy this video. So first we have to get like 180 and above in jump. At least you should have to get at least 180 in jump before you can think of getting admission in so abroad because the abroad cut off mark for jam like not based on cost though like general cut off mark for abroad is 180 yeah so if you have 180 in your jam don't worry you still have a chance to get to abroad not a chance you will still get to abroad for white neck or gc anyone you are using you have to have at least five credits in your course subjects like if you're in science arts or commercial you shall know your course subjects which is like english series literature chemistry biology physics you shall know your course subjects in your course you get know your course subjects in course so you have to have at least five credits in those five course subjects and once you have five um credits in those course subjects i have at least 180 and above and abroad is also your first choice yeah. so that's that about jam boy and neko but since i mean i don't know about before but my own says we did it online like we did it online there was a link then we joined the link and there was no camera but we did it on laptop the questions they asked my says was 80 questions i'm not sure i can't remember but i think 80 questions and it gets to be like mixed up um i think physics english math um, biology i think it's going to be mixed with all of them yes it's going to be mixed questions so yeah you guys should just read for positive me don't worry it's not going to be hard trust me so far you've done why and jump it's going to be hard i'm going to bring back the questions that they've asked your past questions and honestly they're going to bring it again so so i read you revise that's it just all you just need for positive me is just your laptop then your calculator if you need one your pen paper if you need one then for posting semi you just have to be checking your mail on the portal or your portal like the school portal for any information like just always be friends with your mail because your mail will be like where they will also send you admission and different things so just be checking your mail and also be checking the school website for any information like for the posting semi but if you have any other question regarding the posting semi jam boy any question regarding all of that i think i've not said why i didn't explain more you can just ask me in the comment section i will answer you i'm going to put the scholarship offer by the side like the picture of the scholarship offer and how you can apply you can just go to like the school website and look for how to apply for like school scholarship and apply for it yeah i'm going to put it here so you guys should take your time to check it out i think i've answered all i know on that scholarship you guys should not forget to subscribe to my channel let's get to that 400 subscribers Yes, I know I said one is the cut off mark, like it's the general cut off mark for abroad if you are entering, but there is still cut off mark for different courses. Yes, but I'm going to put the picture of the cut off mark here yeah, so you guys can see it and all. But that doesn't mean if you if your jam score is not up to the cut off mark, that doesn't mean you can still enter. So far, you did well in your Y and you did well in your post CME. What's your name again? 
just have hope and even if you don't get your desired course there's still like going to be different option of course for you wish you guys the best in you guys option I've actually done a video where I've explained like all of this thing I'm explaining apart from some of the things I'm explaining now but I'm going to link the video in my description box so you can check my description box if you want like more explanation on Abuad or question and answer based on Abuad I'll keep it in my description box so you guys can check it for pharmacy is lilac purple on black for MHS is red on black for law is white on black for engineering is green on black for sciences is yellow on black so i've gotten to the last point which is so for hostel we have different hostel for boys and different hostel like we have i think four hostel for girls and five hostel for boys but for boys now they just renovated the hostels for boys i think two of the hostel which is kofuki and jamaica they renovated it and like the hostel is really fine based on the videos i've seen on the hostel but i'm sure for boys when you guys resume you guys will see it for the hostel for female we have new female store one new female store two we have wema we have abad abad and wema they are old hostels the difference between wema abad and any fish one and any fish is that the bathroom and toilet is not in the room that's for wema and abad but for new female store one and new female store two the toilet and bathroom is inside the room do you guys so yeah that's the only difference and just check your portal and you can pick which one you want like the, there's option for us and just pick any one of your choice that's that and it's also the same thing for boys so Fuki and jamaica they just um upgraded it so i don't know you guys can check your portal shop for the hostels and all so you guys can pick and see the price for it so i think i've answered everything i have to download for you guys but if you guys still have questions based on the school and different things you guys can just tell me in the comment section i'll gladly answer you guys because i always answer you guys because you guys are my babies yeah so i think i've come to the ending of this video i hope this video was very helpful to you guys and and also don't forget to share to your friends and family um you guys don't forget to subscribe let's get to 400 500 600 700 800 so we get to 1k okay okay that's the goal we must get to 1k like comment turn on my notification bell so that you'll always be the first to know whenever i drop a new video so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys in my next video vlog anyone